हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू विथ चैप्टर नंबर वन विच इज सोर्सेस ऑफ फूड फ्रॉम लिविंग साइंस एंड व्हाट वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस शॉर्ट आंसर्स फ्रॉम दिस लेसन सो लेट अस इमीडिएटली स्टार्ट लेट अस रीड द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन नेम वन स्टेम दैट हैज फूड स्टोर्ड इन इट दिस इज योर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम शॉर्ट आंसर्स ओके name one stem that has food stored in it so what is the answer to this potato potato is an example of a stem that has food stored in it okay let us move on to the next question are humans herbivores carnivores or omnivores well humans are omnivores as they consume both plant and animal products then third question some animals usually eat the dead bodies of other animals what are they called well the animals that feed upon dead bodies of other animals are known as scavengers for example vultures some food chain end at herbivores true or false here you will write true in case of herbivores no with no natural predators the food chain ends at herbivore i repeat the answer is true what was the question some food chains end at herbivores true or false well the answer is true why because in case of herbivores with no natural predators the food chain ends at herbivore only fifth question the chemical substance in food that your body needs are called dash here you will write the chemical substances in food that your body needs are called nutrients what it is called nutrients sixth question do all living things eat the same kind of food no all living things do not eat same kind of food let us see short answer this is question number c the earlier was very short answer this one is short answers first question name the sources from where we get the ingredients used in food here you will write following are the sources from where we get ingredients used in food and then you will write plants animals and earth okay so these are the three sources from where we get ingredients that we use in food second question why are green plants known as producers here you will write green plants use sunlight and carbon dioxide from atmosphere to produce carbohydrates by the process of photosynthesis since plants produce food for themselves they are known as producers okay because these are the only living organism which can produce their own food that's why they are called as producers and how they prepare their food green plants use sunlight and carbon dioxide from atmosphere to produce carbohydrates by process of photosynthesis and since they are able to do this they are able to prepare their own food they are known as producers let us move on to the next question The next question is name three plants and their parts that we eat. Here you can write examples of the edible plants are banana. The fruit is edible. The center of the stem is also eaten. Less commonly, the flowers of the banana tree are also used as food. Then carrot. It is a root of the carrot that we eat. Okay. Then rice. The grains of the rice that are eaten are the seeds of the rice plants. Okay, students. let us move on to the next question in what way is scavenger useful to the environment here you will write scavengers consume dead bodies organisms and prevent them from accumulating in the environment which may lead to the outbreak of disease therefore scavengers keep the environment clean for example termites consume remains of dead plants while vultures consume dead animals so scavengers are important to keep environment clean fifth question why does a mosquito not have teeth here you will write mosquitoes depend upon the liquid diet of either sap or nectar from plants or blood of other animals and since mosquitoes do not consume solids they do not have teeth and we get our food item from plant and animals do you agree give reasons here you will write yes i agree that we get our food item from plant and animals all the food that we eat are either derived from plants such as fruit grains vegetables nuts etc or they are derived from animals such as meat poultry fish then eggs milk cheese butter etc 
well students if you have any questions feel free to ask you can put your questions in comment box thank you for listening to me see you during next session with a new topic until then take care bye bye